Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 19th, but you know the timing is fluid. And this reading is not sign specific, it's not time specific. Take what resonates, leave the rest. We're just going to see what comes up. We're just going to see what comes up. What do we have? What do we have for a message today? Right around the, the solar eclipse, right? Because the, the energy is like starting to come in. Hmm. Queen of Pentacles. So the Queen of Pentacles is a very hard worker. Looks like she has a lot of stability right there. A lot built up. Um, looks like there's money in the bank. You know, there's there's plenty. This is this person has absolutely plenty. Look at all that. Look at all that money right there in that box. So the Queen of Pentacles, she's quite comfortable. Um, she's very loved. She has some animals, some pets. Um, time is ripe, okay? She's ready. She's waiting. She's ready and she's waiting. She has a lot to offer. So we have Queen of Pentacles here, maybe a business owner, a mother. Um, very grounded, down to earth. This person loves to be outdoors. Is uh, Could be a gardener. Um, it looks like it's harvest time to me. It's time to receive, okay? It's time to receive. It does because it looks like everything is ripe. It's time to receive something. Um, she's worked really, really hard. So we have an individual that is about to receive something. It's time. It's, it's time. So this is a, uh, this person is really dependable loyal could be a Taurus Virgo Capricorn could be anybody that I mean this person has their their crap together as you can see there's a lot of uh, abundance very very abundant and she knows her value okay so she's just waiting she's just waiting Ooh, King of Swords reversed. Now, the King of Swords reversed is a dictator of some sort. Somebody that is lacking integrity. That may be cold and abusive, so that's interesting. There's, there's an, there could be an absent father even with the King of Swords. Now, this is a mother. I'm, something is going on here. Now, this could be an absent father. Somebody that is power crazed. Rude, dishonest. Hmm. Ruthless. Abusive. Hmm. Eight of Pentacles reverse. Now the Eight of Pentacles reverse is not putting in effort. So we may have a masculine. This is a feminine and this is a masculine. It is. Okay, you guys don't have to like it. I really don't care. But we have a feminine that, you know, she knows her value. She has a lot to offer. We have a masculine. This is a masculine right here. Okay. Very masculine. That isn't putting in effort doesn't work hard enough, doesn't have a lot to offer. This person may be cold and uncaring. And, and you know, this person is very comfortable, very set by the looks of things. Set. So this person is set. This person is uncaring and cold and abusive, maybe mentally, verbally, whatever it is. Now this could be an actual father, it could be a partner, I don't know, it could be a boss, I don't know what it is, but this is not putting in effort, not working hard enough. Somebody's not working hard enough and it looks like it's the masculine to me. 
I mean, I could sugarcoat it and, you know, say something different, but that's what I feel. Knight of Swords reversed. Now, the Knight of Swords reversed is clueless, ignorant, a know-it-all, somebody that places blame, that is insincere. You know, very similar to the King of Swords reversed, but a little bit more immature. Hmm. This, we could have somebody here that is, uh, you know, has some mental health problems. Blames everybody. Doesn't want to be held accountable for their actions. Hmm. Strength reversed. This is a coward. We have a coward. Somebody in this person, you know, this is weak, cowardly, big ego. So we have an individual here that has a very big ego. This could be even dangerous with the Knight of Swords reversed. This could be a dangerous, because this is, could be abuse. We could have a bully here. This is a bully. This is an abusive individual that enjoys their power, that is very, very controlling. Hmm. The strength can also be poor health, strength reversed. This person may be feeling inadequate, and that's why they are abusive. That's why they're so manipulative. That's why they're so controlling, you know, because they're, they're, they're inadequate within themselves. So they want to overexert their power. There's an abuse of power here. Now, this Queen of Pentacles is very comfortable. Well, we're going to have to clarify that here in a minute. This is not putting in effort. This is a dangerous situation. We have somebody's ego that is through the roof. That's a dangerous situation. Hmm. Ten of Wands reverse. Now this is making a conscious change of some sort. Freeing yourself. Letting go. Hmm. Queen of Wands could be dealing... Now there could be another woman... Okay, there could be a woman here that is very forceful. Doesn't have to be forceful, but this is letting go. And usually the Queen of Wands signifies another woman. The Queen of Wands is very determined. She's determined to win. Very forceful. Energetic. Very proud. So this is very proud. Now this is letting go, the Ten of Wands. Letting go of this woman. Some or This woman is letting go. The other woman may be letting go. Somebody's letting go. Mm hmm Oh, the hangman reverse. Yes. Now, but that is struggling to let go, which is interesting. Refusing to go in and struggling to let go. We have an individual that is obsessed with control. The Queen of Wands is about control, and you guys can get your get your butt all hurt or not, but whatever. Okay, so this is somebody that is very controlling. And this is control, and this is strong control here. Somebody has been under another person's control. And they've been missing an opportunity. There's huge egotism here. Huge. This is, this is somebody that will not change. They want to win. They want to win. They will not change. Which is interesting. Refusing to go in, refusing to look at things from a new perspective. We have a know-it-all here. We have a know-it-all. This person is a know-it-all. 
this know-it-all, whoever this know-it-all is, it feels like they're about, there's some sort of release coming. What is this? What is going to happen for this know-it-all? There's abuse here. There is some sort of abuse. Nine of Pentacles reversed. Unstable, insecure. Can't take care of themselves. We have an individual that can't take care of themselves. They're weak. There's weakness here. There's a lack of strength, okay? But this person may portray themselves to be strong, but they're not. So something is going on here. There's insecurity. This person can't take care of themselves. They're not stable. There's a need for discipline. There's, there is. Somebody needs to find their discipline. Definitely. They need to find their discipline to regain control. It's like something is out of control. Their ego is out of control. Which is interesting. Now, this Nine of Pentacles reversed is you must take action. We have an in, there's no grace. We have an individual that doesn't have any grace. You know, there's a lack of tact. There's a lack of grace. This is a bully. It's somebody that is insincere, somebody that is abusive, mentally abusive, verbally abusive, whatever. This person is very forceful, can't look at things from any other perspective. They know it all. They aren't going to change for any reason whatsoever. I know it all. I'm not going to listen to any advice. I don't need to listen to any advice because I already know. But this person has huge insecurities, huge in, you know, on the inside, very insecure on the inside, very unstable. She's just sitting there, she's very stable. This Queen of Pentacles is very stable, very comfortable. This person looks really good, very, very attractive, but is, it feels like they're mentally unstable. Page of Cups reversed and the Moon reversed. So there's an unrequited love situation. Somebody's bubble is about to be burst. It's the other woman or it's the other person who thinks that they know it all. Somebody's bubble is, bur is, this is, is about to be burst. We have a drama queen here. There's going to be a rejection. There's, there's some sort of... Uh, truth that is about to come out okay because with this moon reverse that's something that's coming out of hiding something is about to be revealed somebody's about to get a reality check there's absent mother here as well or an absent father could be either or or both that has caused this this person's insecurities. That's why this person is so insecure. There's going to be a rejection. There's a, there's there's we may even have uh, we have somebody here that hasn't been able to change their ways, and things have come to a dangerous point. Okay, they've come to in. It's it's become dangerous because this person isn't changing their ways. They refuse to change their ways. They can't. They can't because their ego is so big. They have to look good. We may have somebody here that has a self-image problem. Okay, it's all about their image. It is. It is. But all is not as it seems, and there could be a collapse. The Ten of Wands reverse is a collapse from illness. Somebody could end up collapsing because they're not healthy, okay, and, and they are, are unable to change their ways, okay, so I don't know if somebody's about to collapse, they're very 
unstable they're starting to get weaker and weaker and weaker and weaker so i don't know whose message that is but this appears to be a dangerous situation there may even be a child involved okay with this moon card reversed there is something that is about to be revealed we have there's there's an imbalance here there is there's an imbalance here and i think this um, imbalance whatever it is is about to be revealed okay um now we could be dealing with a pisces cancer scorpio or a uh because this is pisces cancer scorpio we have pisces here and then we have leo aries sagittarius here we have leo here we have pisces here up here we have taurus virgo capricorn these swords are Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Whatever this is, this is a very, there's insincerity here. We have somebody here that is lying. They have been pretending to be stable. They have been pretending to be healthy. They look good on the outside, but on the inside, they're breaking down. Their system is breaking down. They didn't do what they were supposed to do to become healthy. They didn't have the discipline and there's a they kid couldn't find the discipline to change and now there's it feels like they're about to get a reality check. There's a right reality check that is coming with that moon card reversed. This is a dangerous situation with the Knight of Swords reversed. Let's clarify the Queen of Pentacles up there. Three of Wands reversed. Now, the Three of Wands reversed is not prepared. Lack of harmony with others. There's been a delayed arrival. She's been waiting. There's been a delay. There's been a delay. But the, there has. She's been waiting for an arrival. And the arrival, because like I said at the beginning, she's been waiting. Waiting and waiting and waiting for this arrival. But there's been some sort of delay. Why has there been a delay? Somebody wasn't seeing. They weren't seeing because this person was hiding. This other woman, whoever this person was, was hiding who they truly were. So this person wasn't putting in effort with this person because they were dealing with this individual that was pretending to be somebody that they were not. Well, she's been sitting back working on her stability, working on her business, working at her job, focusing on her... Uh, growth, you know, on uh, nurturing herself, nurturing everybody, whatever, you know, building up her stability, you know, um, waiting and waiting and waiting. While this person was pretending to be somebody that they were not, which was affecting this individual that couldn't see that, that wasn't awakened because it's in reverse so we have an individual that wasn't coming they weren't taking any action they weren't they weren't putting in any effort with this queen of pentacles that was stable and it could be any sign here okay so just keep that in mind we, we have a very stable solid individual who has been waiting for this one to wake up and see that they were dealing with somebody that was being fake which is interesting. Temperance reversed. There's been some sort of competition, hostilities, frustrations, emotionally unstable. It's been out of her control. It was out of her control. 
So the Queen of Pentacles has been waiting for something to end because the temp before the Temperance card comes the Death card. She's been waiting for something to end, but it was beyond her control. So all she could do was sit there and wait. There's a fly on oh, my ears ringing. Somebody has been going overboard and they have been engaging in negative patterns and she knew that something was off. But now there's such an imbalance and there's a it feels like she knows that this person has was unbalanced that this person was going to get weaker and weaker like the connection was going to weaken. Now, this is inappropriate behavior. So there's been some sort of inappropriate, she knows, she's looking at inappropriate behavior. So somebody has is not learning their lesson either. And she knows it, she's in the upright. She's very grounded, very realistic, very practical. She knows that somebody is unhealthy. The lovers in a false contract. The lovers reversed. There's going to be a separation with the lovers reversed. Okay, there's going to be a split. It just wasn't time. It wasn't time. So anyway, there's going to be a separation. She's been waiting to hear about this separation. There's going to be. This isn't meant to be. She knew that it wasn't meant to be. Four of Pentacles reverse. Somebody is about to open up. They are about to share. They are about to give. Somebody was staying in a situation just to say that they had something. But there is going to be a separation because somebody is re examining. They are re examining the partner that they are with they're starting to see that they are with somebody that is fake looks real good may have a great body but doesn't have as much to offer stability wise doesn't put in a lot of effort, lazy, won't change, very stubborn. The lover's reverse is a separation. It is a split of some sort. There's going to be a separation. There's a mis there's a misalignment. These two people don't connect well. There's a disconnection. There's going to be a separation. Six of Cups reverse. Somebody's going to be freed from their obligation. Somebody's packing up and leaving home. There may even be some some child abuse here. There could be. There could be some child or a child that was robbed of their innocence because they had a person that was very controlling. Okay, whatever is something is about to be revealed from this about this individual that is very unstable and insecure that has control issues that has uh, brought about a situation that is very dangerous and unhealthy. And I think that there's illness here. There's big time illness. There is. With the temperance reversed and the strength reversed, there's illness here. And I don't know if it's mental illness or, you know, internal illness. There's some sort of illness here which is going to, you know, come to light. This illness is going to come to light. 
and and and, the, and maybe there, I mean I hate to say this, but there even could be a child that is ill. Um, Now the four of pentacles reversed is it's time to open up. And this is letting go of fear. The moon is letting go of the moon reversed and the four of pentacles reversed is letting go of fear. So somebody may be letting go of the fear. They've been holding on to something for fear of being alone with this uh, nine of pentacles reversed. Somebody may, may have been holding on to a false contract or a false partnership that wasn't meant to be because they were scared to, they didn't want to be alone they didn't think that they could take care of themselves but we have the queen of pentacles here who is very capable of taking care of herself she's a hard worker so we do have an individual that is reevaluating their current circumstances and I feel like they have been in an abusive situation, maybe with another woman or with a man that is abusive. There's abuse here. And there's going to be a reevaluation of the situation. And the real truth is about to come out. And that is what I see. So I would like to get an oracle card. I think that I will look for one. Oh, I don't know. Let's see. What are we going to use? I don't use these very often. We'll go for this. One of these, please. Somebody is about to re-examine who they're dealing with, and, the, and they're going to see the truth. And there's going to be a separation. Family. Oh boy, this has to do with family. A family. And that's scary. I know that it is scary. And I see fear. Somebody may have been staying because, you know, there's a family situation here. And I think it's been a mess. I do feel like there's been a very unbalanced family situation that has been going in the wrong direction. And somebody was holding on maybe just for the family or for the child or whatever the case is. I feel as though there's going to be a split. Um, something is about to be revealed. There's some sort of robbing of innocence or abuse or something like that. Um, that is uh, going to be re-examined, re-evaluated. Somebody's going to be re-evaluated for their uh, ignorance. Okay, because the Knight, of, the Knight of Swords reverse is somebody that is very ignorant. Um, so this is a family situation. Um, somebody is going to be freed from their obligations. However that resonates with you. Good luck.